Hi, my name is Michael Jacobs. I'm the Chief Procurement Officer of Staples. As many of you will know, Staples is the world's largest office supply company. Uh, you may not know that we're in the top five in terms of internet uh, retailers. And over half of our business is not in the retail stores, but it's actually with our delivery customers. Since last year, we've had a sharpened strategy that we call the 2020 Vision, which has four planks to it, uh, one of which is a focus on North America. Uh, the second one is running retail for profitability. Uh, the third is a real push and emphasis on our uh, mid-sized customer segment. And the fourth, where I come in from a procurement perspective, is a renewed emphasis on profitability and cost reduction. We started rolling out requisitions uh, last fall. Uh, again, we replaced an old creaky system for part of the business. For the parts of the business that didn't have an, a requisition system, uh, which was most of the business, uh, we're now rolling that out to them uh, sort of as we speak. Since we started to implement it last fall, um, it's really much more about uh, transparency uh, for our stakeholders. Uh, so let me give you an example. Um, one of the heads of our businesses came to me last uh, week and said, uh, Mike, I've rejected a $500,000 uh, requisition. Uh, I don't even know what this is for. One of my people is buying something on behalf of another department. Can you help me with this thing? Well, that's just a case in point. Whether that purchase was justified or not, this is an example where a head of a business doesn't even know what his people are doing. So now we have the tools to give the heads of businesses and other managers out there the transparency uh, that they need. So as we roll requisitions out to the rest of the business, here's what I'm really excited about, is how we manage tail spend with it. Because if you look at our supply base, our supply base, uh, which has in the region of seven, 8,000 suppliers, half of those um, represent spend less than $5,000, if you can believe that. If you add the spend up to a couple of hundred thousand dollars, that's really the bulk of the supply base. So we're very concentrated on, on one end with large suppliers, but then we have this huge long tail to deal with. And my sourcing people always deal on this end with the large suppliers. I've never had the ability to deal with this tail spend over here. And Coupa is going to give us that workflow combined with some new spot buy capability that I put in place to address that long tail of spend. So we've customized the requisition into a web form that now the whole business uses, the whole company, in order to request agency uh, type services. Those all come to a central place now and now we can give them to our third party and saving money in the process. So just scores of opportunities now that we're rolling out requisitions to get our arms around tail spend, you know, and the larger spends and exercise a bit of demand control on that. Well, the primary benefit of Coupa is visibility and control over our entire indirect spend base. And as I mentioned before, we already have that visibility and control on the invoice side. We fully rolled out invoicing, so we are 100% spend under management from an invoice perspective. And we're very much looking forward to full visibility and control of 100% of the spend on the purchase order side. Um, and that's going to give us the ability uh, in this retail world where every penny counts, it gives us the ability to really control the demand on a number of high spend discretionary items. So we're very excited to have that increased transparency on the front end with Google. At Staples, we are now 100% spend under management for indirect purchases.